So what you saying? Stop playing. You got me going insane. The way you shaking that frame, baby. Hold up, that boy lame. He gone. Hey guys, welcome back to the Nova Show. It's your host, International Nova. And in today's episode, we'll have another Freedom Partner Spotlight and some cool music news. So let's get to it. Pop star Kesha and her lawsuit against Sony Records and longtime producer Dr. Luke has turned pretty ugly. Kesha's mom recently went on a Twitter rant calling out Dr. Luke and calling Kesha's obligations to Sony slavery. Now through the tweets, Kesha's mom also stated that she's worried that due to the delay in the case, Kesha's career might be over before the case is settled. Now in other news, Ty Dolla Sign has just released a brand new single called LA, which features Kendrick Lamar, Brandy, and James Fauntleroy. Now the song is the newest single off his new album, The Free TCLP, due out November 13th. You can also stream the song by clicking the link down low. Let me know what you guys think. In other news, Facebook has just released a brand new music feature. Now the feature is called Music Stories and works like this. Any song that is posted on Facebook through a link or through the share on Facebook button within Spotify or Apple Music will appear in news feeds and 30 second clips. Now the only downfall of the feature is that it's only compatible at the moment with iOS users. Now through the feature, if fans find the music interesting enough, you can actually add the songs to your streaming services within Facebook. Now in the past, Facebook's last music feature, which actually tracked your SoundCloud activity, was not received too well. So let's see how this one turns out. Hey guys, so we're back, and as you can see, we're back in my home studio. Now today's Freedom Partner Spotlight goes to a member by the name of Rick Gidham. So let's go ahead and check him out. So Rick, I want to say you got some good production, some really cool beats, and a couple different styles. I really do like where you're going with your production, and you got some really, really great potential. Now, what I will say is, just like I've said in a couple episodes, you want to make sure that as a producer, you have your music everywhere. Now, looking at your page, I couldn't find your social media, and that is one thing I do recommend, is have as much social media links as possible on your profile. As a producer, use the social media tools available, such as Reverb Nation, SoundClick, SoundCloud, and get your music heard. Now, as far as the production itself, there are a few things I would recommend, and as always with me, it starts with the EQ. You want to make sure you take the time to EQ all of your instruments, all of your samples, and get them to sound as clean as possible. As a producer, you want to make sure that all of your tracks sound nice, clean, and polished. So take some time out, focus on your instruments, you want to make sure your snares are nice and tight, and with the kicks, you want to make sure it sounds heavy, not too much where it swallows your whole track, but nice, crisp, and tight as well. Now another trick that I would recommend is adding a vocal exciter to your instruments. Now by adding a vocal exciter to your instruments, this actually adds life to your mix, as well as giving your track a bounce. Now aside from these two things, you also want to work on adding compression, as well as adding reverb to give your track space and presence in the mix. Now as a side note, don't be afraid to pan some of your instruments. Everything doesn't always have to be in the middle. Now as with everything in music, mastering is very important, and lucky for you guys, as beat partners or potential beat partners, we provide mastering for free. So if you guys are interested in joining Beat, please click on the link below. I want to see you guys there. Now guys, as always, you can go ahead and click the SoundCloud link below. Head over to my SoundCloud page and use my music, use my label's music for free on your videos. Now that's it for today's episode of The Nova Show. Thank you for tuning in. Until next time, you guys take care.